Crown and Pound TV, Mark Bergmann hier auf der Abschlusspressekonferenz von UFC und Fuel TV 7 in London. Neben mir steht nun Gary Cook, der Managing Director für Europa und Afrika, der uns jetzt die Frage beantworten wird, wie es in Europa weitergeht und vor allem auch in Deutschland weitergeht. Gary, uh, first of all, thank you for taking the time. Um, you're now about six months on the job. When we first met you, it was uh, in uh, September last year in Nottingham. So uh, looking back to six months, how have they been? What have you experienced? What have you done? And what have you planned for the next time here in Europe for the UFC? Well, the, you know, the, the first thing in any role that you uh, that you join, you've got to try and take uh, take stock of what what, what you have. Um, we've been operating in this market for uh, since 1997, and uh, clearly the UK has been a, a, a key market. So, sort of starting with that, it's about people. It's about what process do we have, and of course, what strategies do we have to, to develop the business. Now, you have a lot to live off uh, with Dana and all the work that they've done in the United States. It's clearly the strongest market. Big growth in Brazil, big growth in Mexico, but we really haven't been able to to develop, um, you know, Europe uh, as a, as a stronger base, a much broader base. So, um, like I say, the, the, I couldn't answer that question in you know in, in 20 minutes, let alone two minutes. Uh, but we're working hard to try and develop a much stronger business than we have now. In September we had the chance to briefly talk to Dana after the press conference about the next show in Europe, a return to UFC to, to Germany, because we are from Germany, and Dana said, yeah, actually the UFC will return to Germany in 2013, and he said they were looking at arenas as we spoke. A couple of months later we talked to him again in Montreal, and he said, you know what, I'm not so sure about Germany anymore, maybe it will happen in 2014. So uh, now I'm asking the man himself, uh, what's the deal with uh, UFC in Germany? The way that you look at the way that I look at uh, Europe, Middle East, and Africa, it's it's uh, we call it a mayor. It's actually a, it's it's not a place. Um, it's a it's a whole bunch of different countries which have a whole bunch of different languages, a whole bunch of different cultures. People react to MMA and particularly the UFC uh, differently in each one of these markets. In France and Germany, we've had some challenges, and 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 we have to be respectful of the position that's been taken by the authorities and by the media organisations. But that does doesn't mean that we should uh, stop trying to give the fans who ultimately decide what they want to consume the product that they want to see. So with that in mind, if you take Germany as an aspect, we've had to build a Germany plan. And in that Germany plan, we've got to have conversations with the TV and broadcast partners. We've got to have uh, conversations with arenas around the events. And we've also got to continue to speak to the governing officials uh, because w there's a lack of un understanding and a lack of awareness. However, you can't stop the fan and their demand. They love the sport. As you know, in Germany, there are people who love that sport. We have a very strong uh, digital community, uh, a website community there. So we've got to find a way to work with the authorities to bring them the product. With that in mind, what we've decided to do in 2014 is look at a particular venue and say, if we have, the, have an event there, can we work back and start making sure that we're satisfying everybody's needs to make this a, a positive experience for everybody. So there will be, this is the last question, no UFC in this year in Germany, but maybe in 2014. That's absolutely correct. Not this year, but maybe in 2014. Gary, thanks very much for taking the time. Uh, know you're a busy man and uh, have a great night.